Former lead singer of Survivor, Dave Bickler, shares some of the tough sides of the music business, some tough lessons he's learned. I'm John Bowden from Rock History Music. Dave Bickler has his own shares of very highs and a lot of lows, like any other musician. I mean, being kicked out as Survivor after having such a big hit with Eye of the Tiger in 1982, after the follow-up album, he had to leave the music industry for a while because of polyps. He was replaced by Jimmy Jameson, had a chance to actually perform with Jimmy Jameson on one of the Survivor tours where his replacement and, and him, they were on stage together, which he says he enjoyed. What's been the toughest thing for you being in the industry? One of the toughest things was that being in a band, I thought we were, it was all uh, one for all and all for one, you know, and all that stuff. I was wide eyed and, you know, <laughs> you know, trusting of everybody. And and I found out that fortunately, nature being what it is, uh, you know, that that I, I found out that it's not the case. <laughs> you know, that people will look you right in the eye and say nice things and tell you they're going to do this and then to do the exact opposite. <laughs> You know, so I guess that would be it, you know, a sort of a, sort of a little sadness about that, you know. So I'm just happy to play music. I'm just glad that I can still do that, that I can still play music and, and record. And I still find recording so much fun to do. And, uh, you know, I'm just glad I still can. Another favorite question on this channel is when was the first time you heard yourself on the radio? That band I was telling you about, that was the Jamestown Massacre. We, you know, this, it's a really weird thing because we were just kids and one of the ki one of the guys in the band, his father was supporting it and wanted his son, he wanted to be, you know, in the music business. And so he, we made that, that's how that record got made. We went to Detroit uh, with something out of the catalog they had at the studio that we, we called, called Summer Sun. And I remember hearing that on the radio in Chicago and I was, that was my, that was my moment of hearing, a, you know, what I always wanted since I was a kid was to hear my record on the radio. Dave Bickler's brand new album is called Dark Light. I'm in love with it. It's my favorite album probably this year. Go to DaveBickler.com for more details. We'll have more from Dave coming up next week. How much more do we have? We have two more in this series coming up next Tuesday. Make sure you comment on our video, subscribe to our channel, and share our videos. I'm John Bowden from Rock History Music. Mm -hmm.